down thy boat! Hello everyone and welcome to the Canadian Redneck Channel. My name is Dave and today we've got a farm all super A here. We're going to rebuild the engine in. So uh, I'll get the camera back where you can see what's going on and we'll get started. We've got our engine disassembled now, so we'll be taking our crank to a machine shop to have it checked and turned. Uh, the main bearings appear to be standard and aren't worn that bad. The rod bearings are two thousandths undersize, and that was a pretty common size you could get for these to make up for a little bit of wear. You know, if they weren't worn too bad, they weren't, weren't worn bad enough to be turned, you could get two thousandths undersize bearings for them. Uh, and that's what these had and the, uh, the rod bearings were quite worn. Uh, yeah, there we go. Every one of them was down to the brass in there. So they had taken quite a lot of wear. And there's some pretty good scratches on the rod journals, but I think they should be able to turn out 20 or 30 thousandths. They should come out of it. I think the main journals aren't too bad. There is some wear. You can feel a little ridge so I mean they'll definitely need to turn but I don't think they're too bad and with our sleeves we need to measure the outside diameter where it fits in the o-ring here because there's two different sizes uh, just off the top of my head I'm thinking three and five sixteenths inches and three and three eighths inches and so we'll have to measure these so we can order our kits and so we'll get these parts uh, get this crank sent away and, and uh, turned ready to go and then we'll get our parts ordered and We'll be ready to start putting things together. So this is the end of part one of our Farmall Super A engine rebuild. Um, when we get the parts back, we'll resume, start putting the engine back together. Uh, you know, stay tuned, keep watch for the rest of this series. Uh, we have more videos in the works. Uh, if you have anything you would like to see, you know, you can leave that in the comment section below. Any questions, comments, anything like that, you can also leave that in the comment section below. Uh, please give us a like and subscribe to our channel. Um, thanks everybody for, for watching my videos. And as always, have a great day.